Which is better, science or religion? Do you have to choose between believing in God and science or can you believe in both? Imagine you have a jigsaw puzzle made up of many different pieces. To see the full picture, you don't just need a few select pieces, but as many as possible. And that's exactly how it is with science and religion. To better understand our world and the universe, we need both perspectives. Science helps us better understand the physical world around us. With it, we can generate electricity or build a car, for example. But there are also things that science cannot explain, such as the meaning of life or why it is important to be a good person. Science and religion are like the wings of a bird. The bird needs both wings to fly. If we engage in too much science, it can lead to materialism. If we have too much religion, it can lead to superstition, intolerance, and fanaticism. An example of too much religion is the Inquisition in the Middle Ages, where people of different beliefs were seen as heretics, were persecuted, and punished. An example of too much science is the development of the atomic bomb in World War II. Scientists worked on the development of this weapon which killed and severely injured hundreds of thousands of people. In both cases, a healthy balance between science and religion was lacking. According to Baha'i teachings, religion must be in harmony with science. If religion conflicts with science, it is wrong. And if science knows no ethical and moral boundaries, it can be harmful. In the Baha'i writings we read, Religion and science are intertwined with each other and cannot be separated. These are the two wings with which humanity must fly. One wing is not enough. Every religion which does not concern itself with science is mere tradition, and that is not the essential. Therefore, science, education, and civilization are most important necessities for the full religious life.